What it do, man? It's your boy Battle Truth coming to you live and direct from the Battle Truth headquarters. Let's get right off into this, man. So, Unbiased dropped his stock drop list a couple days ago in the Battle Rap community, man. <laughs> they going crazy over that, man. That's that's all you hearing about. Niggas apologizing, niggas bigging him up. <laughs> Niggas looking uh, relieved that they didn't make the list. <laughs> like, I'm like, but I've been telling y'all. Same thing I've been telling y'all. And what's crazy about it is they really, look, let me tell you something real. They think that man word is law. Like if he said it, it's true. So if you made the list, it's true. Like literally. And it actually is a count and strike against you. Like really running down y'all lives. Just literally calling y'all out. This I'm talking about like literally, I, I've been saying this for the longest. Like this dude reading these niggas they rights, calling them all out, disrespecting them. <laughs> and he got, ain't got no response to this dude. Just, just taking it so light and so easy on them. And I'm not trying to get people to come at the man. I'm just laying out exactly what's clear that we see and what's going on. Like, this is crazy to me, bro. And I'm just sitting back watching people's responses of who he called out. And it's crazy because these same guys go in on everybody. They go, let it been a battle rapper. Let it not been unbiased and it been a battle rapper that was saying that about them. They'll be going crazy on them. They'll be going crazy on them, spaces on them, Instagrams on them, tweets on them, blogs on them. Like something crazy. But he said, and it's like, well, I guess it's true if he said it. These brothers like, we going to do better. I'm going to try to do better next time. <laughs> These who said they're going to try to do better next time. Like, next time, they're not going to make the list. Like, and Cat's, Cat's waiting for this list to drop like, Champion of the year announcement. I'm like, look, what I've been telling y'all, man. <laughs> I keep telling y'all, look. <laughs> Niggas tried to crucify me for telling the truth about the situation. Even though, look, look, keep it real. I clearly laid that whole thing out before I even made the number. I said, look, this dude is basically a scumbag. He didn't rape women, took women against their will. This dude is waiting trial. He finna go to jail for sentencing. He did all this. But even though he did all this, guess what? The battle rap community still don't care about none of that. They sit all that to the side. And if you look at the numbers, you still have to say he's a top 10 battle rap blogger. They don't care about his background. They don't care about what he's awaiting trial for. They don't care about what he did. You know what I'm saying? When you getting stock drops, untold truths, fan mails, they don't care if that dude, they don't care if that dude took women against their will. They don't care about this dude awaiting trial. We showed them, we showed them the pre-trial. We showed them the pre-trial of them bringing in the evidence, basically saying uh, 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 the trial is on the way. This is what we're going to use in trial. What's not permissible at trial, we want to argue. What's not going to be used and what can be used. Like, we literally showed them that. <laughs> Nigga's crazy, boy. But, I mean, it is what it is. Like like I told the man before, look, again, I ain't got nothing against the guy. However, you will be judged for what you did to the women. It's going to happen. I'm talking about, I don't care. Look, I don't care what, what the battle rap do. I don't care what battle rap do. 
I know what God going to do. Okay? I can, I can care less about battle rap. Hell, they can love you all day long. They can keep sending you cash apps. They can keep subscribing. They can keep giving you thousands and thousands of views. I know what God going to do. I know that. <laughs> I know that. And when it's all said and done, it's it, it's coming soon and soon. And he know it. But like I told him, <coughs> look, if I was you, like I said, if I was him, I'm fighting the fight of my life. I'm about to do life in prison for raping women, taking them against their will. I ain't never came to God, but I definitely need him now. I'm telling you, I'm, I'm just keeping it 100. He won't do it, though. He still ain't going to do it. Because that, 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 that spirit that's in him, it won't allow him to do it. It won't allow him to do it. And then he getting so much love from the battle rap community. He don't, the battle rap community have convinced this man he didn't really do nothing wrong. You know that? Like, like, like all, all jokes aside on some real stuff, they have convinced this man that what he did, he didn't really do nothing wrong. And what happened to the women was deserving of him. They, they have literally did that. That man literally on numerous of videos saying, I don't care what y'all show. Ain't nobody going to care. Remember that man said that you can put up the paperwork. They still ain't going to care. They don't care. Nobody cares. He said that, like really taunting us, really like provoking us, really like, <laughs> really like rubbing it in our faces. Okay, so what you put up my six felony rapes? So what you showed my documentations and paperwork? So what y'all caught me in all these lies? So what my victim came out and said what I did to her and moved in her neighborhood? So what? And? You see, they still like me, right? You see, I still get... Remember you rubbing that in our face? You see, they still show me love and shake my hand like Jay Black. You see me caked up. You see me in events. You see them all showing me love. You see my channel steady growing. And then said it again. Nobody cares. And this is what I'm saying. Look, pride comes before the fall. God will use these same people that's actually co-signing and not seeing nothing wrong with what you're doing to lay the hammer down for your judgment. That's what it means. The enemy used them to stroke your ego, to exalt you to a place of arrogance where you believe you untouchable. Then what happens? The hand of God come down on you. And all those things that was actually so-called supporting you, showing you love, all gone. Yeah, they honor that, man. I'm, I'm sitting there tripping. Like, literally, cats apologizing. Cats promising to do better. Cats, <laughs> like, stroking the dirt off their shoulder, like, so what? Nobody challenging this man. None of them coming at him, but they come at each other, don't they? They come at each other, don't they? I'm talking about them battle rappers. Tear each other apart. They say the least thing against one another. They tear each other apart. This dude literally trying to tap their pockets to not get them booked, to get them out of here, and they acting like, yeah, it's ain't nothing. Video over 20,000 already. <laughs> it's the talk of battle rap right now. The cat's acting like it's nothing. I'm trying to tell you, boy. <laughs> it is what it is. Look, I'm used to it, man. It is what it is. I already know. But look, I don't do this for them. I do it for the truth. And it is the truth. Simple as that. You know, I want the brother to turn his life around. I want the brother to do right. I want the brother to know that even though he in a bad situation, 
it ain't over because you still got life. But I'm and I, but I'm trying to show him the way out that's actually real. And it's crazy that it takes things like this to happen for brothers to come to the knowledge of the truth. But it still is no excuse for people to ignore and set aside the man actions of what he did. How do he supposed to be rehabilitated if he's not being uh, 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 held accountable for his actions and actually making a mockery out of the people that's here? Like literally making a mockery out of the people that's here. But guess what? One thing he do know, right? Look, look, one thing he do know, <laughs> one thing he do know, right? He do know this, don't he, y'all? One thing I respect about Battle Truth, and I will say this, when I got locked up, he said I was guilty. When I was in jail a year, he said I was guilty. When I was in jail two years, he said I was guilty. When he heard I was coming out, he said I was guilty. When I got out, he said I was guilty. And even right now, he said I he kept the same energy. And I always will. And I always will, period. I saw the paperwork. I saw the victim. I spoke to one of the victims. I spoke to the victim. I saw the paperwork. I saw the transfer. I saw the 23 grand jury indictment. I saw the evidence. So you damn right. I'm going to keep the same energy. Nothing ain't changed. And every time I type up your name and I see six felony rape charges remaining in trial, I don't care how long it's taken. I understand court. Because I know how courts go. Hell, I fought my case for over a year. It wasn't no rape case. It wasn't no pedophile cases. It was a drug case. And I fought that for over a year. We see, we seeing all on the internet. Hold on. They YFM Lucci and them just got sentenced. That was years ago. And what's crazy, he took a plea. He didn't even go to trial. He took a plea. His case has been going on for like four years, three, four years, and he just took a plea. <laughs> what are you talking about? Hell. Uh, the other dude, the double homicide dude, he just had a hung jury. His stuff went back five years. I know how courts go. Hell. They thinking because he out on bond. And it's been a few years. Well, well, I guess. And he and Chris used that to his advantage. Told y'all. See, I'm still out because he know they don't know a damn thing about court. You know, they don't know nothing about court. But these people, let, let me tell you something. These people know better. They want to use that as an excuse to keep supporting the man so that uh, it can justify what they doing. That's that's all that is. You get what I'm saying? They They know the truth. They ain't stupid. They they search it. They be on this internet all day long, channel to channel, running across all type of information to know how this stuff go and what be going on. This ain't the only community they listen to. Battle rap community. They watch all this stuff, and it's been so much crime, so much cases, so many people been on trial for years after years after years for them to understand and know that this is part of the protocol that happens when you catch those type of cases. Yeah. They just want an excuse to justify keep doing it. So any little thing they can get to, so that they won't be uh, 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 held accountable either or have to give an answer for what they do, they gonna justify you by that. Oh, he did that while he out. Because it's called bail. That's why it's out. It's called bail. What part of bail don't you get? Get up out of here. But here it is. He dropped the stock drop list and it's law. And ain't none of them really saying nothing about it. They so polite they so kind. Like, y'all really scared of a blog? Y'all scared to say something? Like, if you say something against him, he gonna drop a blog on you? Y'all scared of that? Y'all y'all scared of that man looking into your background? 
how to rape a man looking at other people's background. Like, you the rape a man. <laughs> like, <laughs> unless <laughs> they got rape in their background. Hell, I can care the less. Look, 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 all the hell you want. I'm going to tell it like it is. <laughs> hell. Terrible, man. People terrible. <laughs> These people so terrible. <clears throat> he got them shook. Like they literally shook. Can't get them. Can't get them to go in on him. Verb be on, on his little thing all. Can't get him to say nothing against somebody. He tried to threaten to throw it out there. Well, I'm waiting for you, Chris. Say something, Chris. I need you to give me a reason. Give me a reason, Chris, and I'm going to get you. Ooh, my view going to go up so high. Well, you can't do that no more. Man knocked on your damn door asking for head. <laughs> these, these dudes, these dudes crazy as hell. <laughs> Shut that whole damn operation down. <laughs> you so humbled now? Quiet. <laughs> that man came through that damn door with it with it damn draws down. He had a damn Care Bear stomach. He had, he had a damn Care Bear stomach. It lit up like a power. <laughs> he asked for some of that. He asked for some of that St. Louis head. Yeah, you moved to Atlanta. <laughs> the, the capital, the capital of man sex. Roman sex. <laughs> I'm biting down there too. Woo, all of them moved to Atlanta. <laughs> when they love masquerade Roman outfits. <laughs> right. Daring each other. I wish you would tell on me. I'm a t you tell on me, I'ma tell on you. <laughs> These people crazy, man. It is what it is, though, man. It's your boy Battle Truth. It ain't my judgment. That's some question. It's yours.